Hey there, guys. Check it out. We're looking at the new Torres SP16 software. Well, software and firmware updates, but most importantly, it's the big 1.4 update that everybody was waiting for. So as you may or may not know, I had the SP16, and my biggest gripe about that thing was from a DJ situation, it sucked because my live sampling ability wasn't there. You had to just jump through a lot of hoops in order to do any of the live sampling. So then I read that this update was going to happen and all this stuff was going to happen. But you know what? When I saw the DJS 1000 come out, I thought, you know what? I only had the SP16 for a couple of months. I lost a little bit of money, not too much. Took it back, got the DJS 1000. The sampling button on it is right there. It's great to sample with. But let's get back to the main point here. They said they were going to add this. And guess what? They didn't add anything like that at all. After reviewing feedback from the Torres SP16 users, we re we've removed the previously announced live sampling function from this firmware update. Live sampling may be included in a future update when it can be adapted to better suit users' needs. Like I told everybody, it was real simple. When everyone kept saying to me, oh, you should have waited, you should have waited. And I said, you know what? How are you going to put a sampling button on it? Simple. No, oh, you do it through the screen. No, they didn't do it through the screen. Everyone kind of got, I don't want to say that they got screwed, but they kind of did get screwed because people were holding out, waiting out for over, for like a year, waiting for this amazing update. Um, so I'll tell you a couple things it can do, though. Maximum sample length, 64 seconds. I can only hope and pray that on the DJ side of things, they can do the same thing. And I kind of doubt it because my understanding is on the S on the DJS 1000, it's got 256 meg, and that's all it has for the sampling part of part of it. So, if it only has 256 meg, and you've got 16 pads times 16, well, at a you know one meg per sample is what they're saying. That's kind of why. But you know what? I don't need to use all 16. So I guess it is possible to say you know what? Give me 32 second sampling, and maybe I only have you know eight scenes I can work with. I'd be fine with that because I don't even need eight scenes, to be honest, for my sampling. So this is it. Um, let's look. They improved the response time when you turn the pots quickly. Dave Smith, filter, uh, Dave Smith filter settings can be saved per scene. Improve response when pressing the back button on the browse button. Playback muted when you mute a track in the same choke group. Uh, the bar display in the current playback position didn't appear in, preview, in previewing a sample on the sample edit screen. Change the names of folders to store project samples and scene files. So I'm just wondering here, when they say they change the names of folders to store project samples and scene files, that means for all you guys that have all your work done, now you're going to have to move all that sh shit around because, yeah, you're just going to have to move it around. And I'm hoping it means as well, too, that they lined it up with the uh, DJS-1000 to be able to take the stick from a Toraz and just plug it into a DJS-1000 and work. Because I'm assuming that was the whole deal. They want you guys to own the, uh, the Toraz to make your stuff and then hop into a club and the club would have a DJS-1000 sitting there and you just plug your stick in and you would just play your stuff in an ideal world, but... I don't think it really works like that. So uh, we'll see. Anyways, guys, uh, that's the update we've all been waiting for. Some of us were waiting, and, and some of us jumped ship. I was one of those guys. I jumped the ship. I'm very happy with my DJS 1000. I still say if you're a DJ, and that's primarily what you're doing, this is the unit for you. If you're a producer, the Torahs does make sense completely. So let's not have a big debate about who's better. They're both part of the same family, and... Um, this is why I'm making the video. Anyways, guys, I will talk to you soon, and hopefully this sheds some light on the new update for you.